Three days after the arrest of an oil vessel, Christian M.T. Kali off the coast to fire the state by Tantita Security Services, which is a private firm contracted by the federal government to secure oil facilities in the Niger Delta region. The security outfit have buried the vessel and 12 crew members along the Escrivos waterway in Wari's southwest local government area of Delta State. Our correspondent, Dele Fasson, completes the story. Fielding questions from newsmen, the executive director of operations, Tantita Security Service, Captain Waridi Eniswo, said the security outfit have been tracking the vessel before the arrest. Precisely uh, a few weeks ago, we were interested in this ship uh, because uh, it's been operating in Nigeria and international waters illegally. It's been carrying crude oil and uh, illegal or illegally refined automotive gas oil, popularly known as uh, cooked diesel, within the operations of Nigerian waters. It has also been carrying crude oil to ships internationally for SDS operations, so much and so forth. So it's been around for a couple of years, but uh, certainly this time around, it was not able to carry out its act successfully and apart. So intelligence came in and we had to process the intelligence and uh, we had to share that intelligence on a need-to-know basis uh, so that uh, the operation... On his path, a vessel captain who admitted the illegality said he was directed to convey the AGO, otherwise known as diesel, but ended up siphoning crude oil. This is as the Tantita security operational head also took time to tell Nigerians that the real oil thieves are those campaigning against the security outfit. The private security outfit vowed to contribute its quota in ensuring Nigeria attains its target of 2 million barrels per day. They gave us this right that we should go to uh, Bayesha Mid meeting that uh, we are going to bring a AGO, come back to Lagos. So that was instruction given to us. And the agent who was supposed to connect us either to the ship or to me, I, I don't really know much. So uh, when, I, when I got there, I, I dropped anchor, I spoke with the agent, which also, as in his statement, he, said, he confirmed that it was AGO that was his original plan to come and load. So at which point, he now turned to the crew. That was what uh, I'm still baffling. I'd also like to seize this opportunity to let Nigerians know that those who campaign against the private security companies in participating in this fight against oil theft are the bunkers. Anybody who campaign against this fight is a bunker. Take it from here. But I said so. So they can continue. But we will not relent. We will not resist our efforts towards fighting this. We will continue to be resilient and we will definitely assist the country in resolving this. Assist also the Nigerian security forces who are happy to participate in securing our assets to do this job. From Warren Delta State, Daily Fast on reporting for Galaxy News.